Hi guys, this is Stephanie. Um, today I'm going to show you guys how to manipulate a stencil so that it will fit around an odd shape. Um, so in this case I'm going to be changing my pattern so that it fits around a flower pot. And I'm going to do this by using the arc tool. So I'm going to go ahead and start by clicking on my pattern here that I found and I'll put the link to this uh, free pattern on the blog if you guys want to use it. Um, so what I'm going to do is first I'm going to start by clicking on the ink saving button and I'm just going to turn my pattern into a line drawing um, and I'm going to do this by clicking here and you can see it's turned my pattern into a beautiful traceable black and white line drawing so I'm gonna go ahead and apply that okay so I have my traceable line drawing here now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on the arc tool and I'm just going to drag this a little bit to bend my pattern and you can see here, maybe a little less. So when I print it, this part will go around the bottom of the flower pot. And as it gets wider at the top, this will wrap around. And it's going to look really cool. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And now I'm going to print. So I'm going to make my... The width of my flower pot is about 28 inches and this is going to distort my pattern a little bit. See here it looks pretty distorted but it's still going to look fine once I transfer it onto my pot. I'm just going to show you guys the PDF here and you'll see that it's a little bit distorted but still it'll still be traceable and it's still gonna look cool okay so I've printed my pattern and now I've taped it to my flower pot with a piece of carbon paper uh, face down on the flower pot and now I'm just gonna go ahead and trace over my design using a pencil or a pen so that the carbon paper underneath transfers the pattern. Now that I have fully transferred my pattern using my carbon paper image transfer method, I'm going to go ahead and paint my design. So this is the final product. Um, this crap took a while to paint, as you can imagine, but uh, it was a really fun one. Got to use a lot of color. So let me know if you guys like this craft um, by liking this video. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Pinterest, and Instagram. Thanks, guys.